Hi, Debate Matrix here. Some of you have been probably wondering where I've been. Uh, well, my uh, real computer has had a nervous breakdown and shut down. It didn't really have a nervous breakdown. It's an inanimate object. I'm not really sure what's wrong with it. Um, it doesn't boot right now, so eventually you got to take it to the shop, pay an extraordinary amount of money, and get it fixed. Um, I don't have an extraordinary amount of money or even a way to get out to the shop right now, so I can't do that. Um, in the meantime, I'm using a laptop, um, and although it has a webcam, it doesn't have any recording software, so I'm doing this live from my webcam, which is extremely frustrating for a number of reasons. One is I can't edit it. Another is that... Um, it only allows about 15 minutes. Um, I tried to, I wanted to analyze and talk about a couple of videos that I found on YouTube just to have a different sort of thing to do on this channel, but I can't do that right now either because of the limitations. You know, I mean, I've got this rubber crab looking at you rather than my impossible square that's my normal avatar, so I, I really feel limited here. But I want to give you an update um, and a, a little bit about the Craig Hitchens debate. Again, this is not about who's right or who's wrong. It's only about who's technically right or wrong within the format of how debate works. Um, somebody had suggested to me, uh, not in comments, but off off uh, YouTube, that perhaps it's because uh, Hitchens doesn't use the A, then B, then C formula, that that's why he's losing so many points. No, 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 not at all. Um, you don't have to follow the technical format of debate to present a persuasionary, uh, persuasionary dialogue that would still f uh, achieve technical points. Uh, the reason he's losing so many points is he kind of just asks questions. He kind of just... Um, says things and, and doesn't really give us reasons to think that those things that he's saying are true. And mostly he's losing points because he's not refuting directly what his opponent has said. Um, he, he, I understand what he's doing, which is fine. He's trying to make the audience think. That's great. No, I don't have a problem with that. If Craig was doing that, um, you know, oh, come on, don't you think that it's just an absurd thing that the universe came here by itself without uh, an intelligence behind it. If he did, if he had said something like that, he would have lost a technical point. Uh, he doesn't. He doesn't say that. He might be hinting at it. It might be suggested, but I haven't really seen that yet. If I do, he'll lose a point. Um, if you want to point out where it is, um, that's great. You do that. But again, Hitchens needs to do that to get a point, not you or I. Uh, we can sit there and go and come up with a better debate against Craig or against Hitchens uh, based upon what we know. But that's not an analysis. <laughs> that's just us going, well, you know, I could outdo them. Well, yeah, sure, you could if you give enough time and thought and effort and energy into it. Uh, what I'm really interested in is some help here. I'd love if any of you have seen a debate that you want and uh, analyze later on um, that you think is really well done or follows the technical formats, uh, send me it. Because I really have not found uh, two debaters go at something that where both debaters really know their stuff. I, I just haven't found it yet. Uh, I know it's out there. I just haven't seen it myself yet. Um, after I am done with the analysis, I plan to get back to just teaching debate in general for a while. And then the next thing I will try to analyze is uh, one of the pre uh, presidential debates that I have favorited. Um, you know, I really wish they wouldn't call it debate because there really isn't much debate. It's kind of an information gathering dialogue. But, you know... It is what it is. Any rate, um, see you soon. Hopefully my computer will get fixed um, soonish. I don't know. Uh, but until then, just you know, uh, you know, feel free to go out, get books on logic, and, and learn how to debate because that is what this channel is um, 
purpose is to teach you debate, but not everybody learns from reading. Many people do learn from hearing, so um, hopefully I can return to that soon. Uh, take care. See you soon.